it for me? Oh, thank you so much. Now in just a moment, you're gonna tell me you don't need a new iPad for that. And I'm gonna tell you you're right. I don't need a new iPad for that, but I do need a solution to this flipping $20 smart ring that I hate. Well, I don't know that I hate it. But up until a few weeks ago, I've been wearing this, hold on, rather sexy silicon, oh, got a bit of fluff on it, silicon wedding band. So I want to put all of the tech that's in here inside of a silicon band. Now I have the silicon, is here, and I have the 3D printer, which we got, I've been struggling with it for the longest time, but I printed out some toes the other day. And those toes will be going on the old Shrek, Shrek Crocaroonies, Shrekaroonies. That doesn't tell you what my actual problem is, does it? Now I had a little look on Amazon and I found that you can buy ring molds that you just pour your silicone into and job's done, but that's not what I need here. See, I need a custom ring mold that incorporates the tech that's inside of here and then turns it into a somewhat flexible band. So ye old iPad Pro and Apple Pencil Pro are gonna help me design that. So we've got Pencil Pro, iPad Pro, and the Magic Keyboard. Just base models of everything. Now I'll tell you what, I think this project's gonna take longer than one day and because this is a daily vlog, we'll get as far as we can. So, you know, I'm not a massive fan of normal unboxing, so let's try, try something a little bit different. First time trying this. Ugh. Wrong spot. I mean, that still seems off. Just a little bit. Wolf away. Put this ring back on for now, it feels weird without it. Take you off. Hi, do da. Well, that's not gonna <laughs> stick, is it? Sorry, do did I scare you? Bummer. All right, we'll do the iPad first. We all agree to the rules, right? Especially you. It's not gonna be a problem with me. All right, so I guess I'll start. First one. Oh, satisfying, right? That's it. Yeah, well now I just get the flipping boring bit, the one that's already been done. All right, that's it. Sweet, I get the, uh, like, the slow unboxing. Take your bloody time, will you? It's like a little tease. Don't rush me. Oh, damn it, can't see it yet. All right, you go next? Yeah, I'll grab it, don't worry, cheers. Wax paper. Yeah, all right, all right, pass it over. It's my turn now. Don't get two goes. What do you mean, pull it out of the box doesn't count. I've still got the wax paper to do. No, he's right. Pass it over. So stupid, you grab it yourself. All right, you're gonna play that game, are you? Thanks for having my back. Well, hey, hey, easy, big fella, that's your one. Give it my turn. That's absolute rubbish, that doesn't count. I'm sure you it does. Oh, hold on a minute, that was, that's at least three. Yeah, I don't know, that was pretty sus, mate. That was really sus. That was three, wasn't it? Give it to him now. You lot are just being zesty. Look how thin that is, look how thin that is. Yeah, I look how thin this is. I'm not zesty though, am I? Mate, look at the size of that. What? No one asked for it to be thinner though, did they? Check this out. Mm, it, I don't even understand how it, what it feels like at the moment. I don't know, my missus is calling. Can you put this on charge, please? You are always making me do your bloody dirty work. Nice job. All right, we know the other bits that are in here, so just gonna go straight with the Apple Pencil. Oh, I get to be the first one again. Well, that's not bloody fair again, is it? Mate, that, that's not fair, is it? I don't really care. Do it. You're flipping useless, help yourself. Bloody hell, what's going on here? Give me that. What do you think you're doing? Oh, look at that. You don't get to see this until last. Look at that pencil. You want to take that out? Oh, it's gorgeous, isn't it? Takes me back to rolling cigarette papers. No jokes for you. No, yeah, pass it over. Just because you messed up doesn't mean I don't get my turn now. Mate, that's just cheap. Come on then. Thank you very much. Shoing, shoing. Isn't it meant to have like haptic feedback? You can feel it buzz. Probably dead, isn't it? Need to charge it. And I guess that's my job again. All right, so I think it was on the top edge next to the camera. By the way, I have 
that's my first time trying that edit. So if you liked it, then I'm glad. If, if not, I won't do it again. <laughs> To be quite honest with you, all the techie specs doesn't really mean much to me. But the Apple Pencil Pro only works with the new iPad Pro or iPad Air. And it has some cool features that I, I want to just test out first. I should, I should also tell you. This is the... One of the... This is one of the iPad minis. And I have some knockoff Apple Pencil. So it charges in here. And it just has the very basic features. It's magnetic, but it doesn't have magnetic charging. And if I'm honest, I think it's the Pencil Pro that makes this Apple release and this new iPad different from any other release. And the thinness, but who really cares about that? All right, here we are then. Get you out of the way. On top of the case will do. I've got the memory of a sieve, so I'm taking a picture of all of those. We've got four new features, squeeze. Oh, yeah, nice little, nice little tickle in there. <laughs> Double tap to switch as you write. Write in any text field and your words will automatically transform into type text. And then capture screenshots from bottom left. See, this is a game changer. So squeezing, can I? I can't from here. I can't screen record yet, but. So I use a daily planner. I should use a daily planner every day. And I use the different pens and erasers, but by squeezing, you see how this comes up here and I can choose which one I want to use versus having to go down to here, pick and select each one. But yeah, look at all these pens. Oh, very nice. What's next there, pet? All right, you wanna see how bad my handwriting is? This is gonna be embarrassing. I feel like the longer it takes to figure out the word, the worse the handwriting was. Tap and hold with your pencil in any editable field to make room. Oh, cool. Let's join. Okay, cool. Well, I don't know where that went. <laughs> I'm not here to do lots of writing. I'm here to design something very special. What's up, dude? So let's go App Store and find 3D modeling. Shaper? You see, I could just do this on my Mac, but I've tried and I found it really difficult. And it seems like an OS, an iPad OS or an iOS version is way easier to do. And I kind of like the idea of doing it with a pencil versus all just manually with a mouse and trackpad. Don't you, Duda? Yeah. Duda, you got some nappy hair, dude. All right, while that downloads... Oh God, look at your hair all over it, Duda. Gross. Gross! That's taking bloody ages to download. So while that downloads, we should try taking this apart, shouldn't we? I don't really know where to begin. This is throwing my mojo off. I can't concentrate. I'm one of those uh, ADHDers. I don't really care what the name is. I'd like to say that everything in this room has its place. But it's not always the case. It's just kind of a mess everywhere. And I feel like a future project should be to put some wheels on this bad boy. Oh gosh. And then I'd probably be able to move it around without feeling like an absolute chump. What am I doing? I think I'd like to make that a future project. I'll tell you, one of my major problems is that I have so many things I want to do that that's what stops me from doing any of them. But I'm starting to get more and more used to this idea that... Oh no, what? Lefty, loosey, righty, tighty. That's right. That's loose. And I'll tell you the toughest thing is doing something the way you want to do it instead of doing something the way others would enjoy it. Does that make any sense? The app is downloaded and I still haven't gotten anywhere to pulling this apart. I think I'm just gonna have to go brute force. Hello, Duda. What are you doing, Duda? Let's bring it over here. Now, I do think an angle grinder would be the best start, but I don't really have much in the way of tools. I'm wondering if a mini screwdriver and a hammer. Now, my hammer isn't in here, so we're gonna go with just a tripod. And I think we go for the side without any 
metal. And I've got it resting on a cage. Not the best start. Let's get some light on the subject. Yeah, I feel like my goal is just to shatter this glass. The plastic, whatever this is in here. This isn't gonna work. Take the whole thing in. Here we go. Right, give it a good that way. Oh, come on, Oliver, hit it with your purse. Just to rest on something. Oliver, you might have just become a genius. Bigger one. That's what she said. Wait, if this works. This is probably painful to watch for you, isn't it? Oh, interesting. We have a plasticky film that's coming apart. Ow! Well, I don't think it's waterproof anymore. <laughs> Ow! Hopefully that wasn't the circuit board I just ripped. So it has this plasticky layer on the inside here, but there's also something else on the inside, and I'm wondering if that's part of the chip. Sorry, my wife just sent me a video of our baby laughing for the first time. I'll be right back. See, now I'm starting to peel away from the electronics and I have to be a bit more careful. Get my soldering tweezers out. They're too weak. <laughs> Interestingly, even if I fail and I break something this time, I'm gonna understand how this ring is built and I'm gonna understand the size so that I can make the mold and just order another one of these to take apart maybe a little bit more gently. <laughs> I see writing that says battery and I'm pretty sure that can't be good. Okie dokie, all right. Oh yeah, I understand it now, I think. Ow! Let me get it apart and then I'll explain it. Oh, here we go. Last little bit. Thumbs cramping up. Oh, so that's the battery that's all stuck in there. I think this is it. You feel like focusing? That is, that's all the tech that I need to clean up. Does it still transmit? Or have I actually broken it? Bracelet's been disconnected. Have I ruined it? Have I broken it? I have, I've broken it, haven't I? Oh yeah. See this part here should still be attached and I've broken that. So it looks like we have the battery which wraps around the outside, which of course links into all of the rest of the chips here. Darn it. So this iPad didn't arrive until like three-ish and it's time to put the boys down to bed flip my day around. So I'm gonna be back in a bit. A couple of books and put them down. We'll see. Is this on? Yes, it is, beautiful. Oh man. Okay, let's come over here. That was two and a half hours of reading and trying to get him to sleep. And I'm hoping he's asleep, but I am done for tonight. But I do wanna explain something to you. I wanted to get a lot further than I did today, but that yes, I need to order another one of these. <laughs> But I now know the height that this silicon ring has to be at minimum. I've just realized. If I could get acetone in between the metal outer ring and inside of here, I can melt the glue, destroy the glue, I'm not really sure. And then I can pull out this whole piece and I can stick this whole piece inside of a piece of silicon because it's the charger here, this metal, see this metal port in here? That's what needs to be at the surface for me to be able to charge it. I don't have time to finish this tonight, so for tomorrow, we can start working on the design, and then uh, I ordered a rotary tool so we can start breaking down the toes over there and get them on some Crocs. <laughs> I didn't even get a chance to use this bloody Apple Pencil, sorry. I'm not gonna drag this on any longer. I'm sorry we didn't get to do much on the iPad. We will tomorrow, okay.